movie written, produced, and directed by a Turner's Falls native hits the theaters this weekend. 22 News reporter Jennifer Zarate joins us from our Franklin County Bureau where she spoke with Turner's Falls residents excited the film was shot in their town. That's right, Barry. A lot of recognizable Turner's Falls locations are featured in the film. The man who killed Hitler and then the Bigfoot. We saw this bar right here on a Hollywood screen. It was fantastic. That is Turner's Falls Hubie's Tavern located on Avenue A, where the opening scene to the man who killed Hitler and then the Bigfoot was shot. The owner told 22 News of all the places they could have shot in town, he was honored they chose Hubie's. It was amazing. Uh, it was a three-day process, so uh, it was a Monday. They came in and they just took everything out, and uh, they, they turned the clock back to the uh, 1980s when that was supposed to be a, a film. So um, it, it was uh, amazing to watch them work. They were Everybody was professional. The people were great. The movie was written, produced, and directed by Turner's Falls native Robert Kraskowski. Bob was saying when he wrote it, actually, he, he this was where he pictured it to be. One Hubie's regular told 22 News, having local establishments highlighted in the film has been exciting to see. It's great for the town. This is our bar and our barber is right next door. Which also made it to the big screen, Ed's Barbershop. The owner told 22 News it was nice of Bob to write her barbershop into the film and with its original name. It made a lot of people really happy in town. I think the title keeps people interested and wanting to know what it's about. So yeah, it was a really a great time for us. The film premieres tomorrow, February 8th, with showtimes in Greenfield, starting at 1230 in the afternoon. Reporting live in Greenfield, Jennifer Zarate, 22 News.